Matthew is the 26th chapter and verse 38. And then said he unto them, My soul is exceedingly sorrowful, even unto death. Tarry ye here, and watch with me. And when he went a little further, and fell on his face, and prayed, saying, O oh, my Father, if it be possible, let this cup pass from me. Nevertheless, not as I will, but as thou will. The 40th verse, and he cometh unto his, uh, his disciples, and find them asleep, and said unto Peter, What could ye not watch with me for one hour? 41st verse. Watch and pray that ye enter not into temptation. The spirit indeed is willing, but the flesh is weak. And he went away again the second time and prayed, saying, O oh my father, if this cup may not pass away from me, except I drink it, thy will be done. And he came and found them asleep again, for their eyes was heavy. And he left them and went away again and prayed the third time, saying, the same word. Then cometh he to his disciples and said unto them, Sleep on now, and take <laughs> and, and take your yeah, and take your rest. Mm -hmm. And behold, the hour is at hand, and the Son of Man is betrayed in the hands of the sinners. Arise and let us be going. Behold, he is at hand, and that do betray me. Mm -hmm. My text is coming from, let's go all the way up to the 41st verse. Watch, well, no, let's go back up to the 40th verse, I'm sorry. And he cometh unto his disciples, and find them asleep, and said unto Peter, What, could ye not watch with me? One hour, the 41st verse, watch and pray that ye enter not into temptation. The spirit indeed is willing, but the flesh is weak. So, my text this morning, oh glory to God, my text is watch while you wait for change. Watch while you wait for change. Oh, glory to God. You know, um, in this chapter, you know, I, I started thinking about that my Lord and Savior was pretty well at the latter part of his ministry to, mm -hmm. to facing death. The Bible said that he was, he, he was very sorrowful and he, and he was, and he was, he was heavy. And, 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 you know, in his heart, you know, because that, as we look, is that he was in the garden of Gethsemane. He was in the garden. And he took Peter, and he took Zebedee and two sons. And Jesus, Jesus was, Jesus was, Jesus was heavy. You know, he knew that it was his, it, it was his time to die for the sins of the world. And he went away and he began to pray. He began to pray, said, Father, if it be thy will, you know, take this cup from me. But he said, but nevertheless, let thy will be done. And that was in a, that was in uh, another translation as well. But he asked Peter a question, could you not just pray, so just watch and pray 
just for now. Mm-hmm. And in this day and time is that we find out that that a lot of believers, a lot of Christians are not watching. They're, they're not watching. They're not, they're not aware of their surroundings. They're not aware of the time, <coughs> the time that we're living in. They're not aware of that the, the, that the word of God is being fulfilled every day. Every day that the word of God is being fulfilled. Mm-hmm. And it, see, because as we look, as we watch, and we see that what Jesus said in, in Matthew, the 24th chapter, he said that in the last days that, you know, many shall, many is going to be deceived. That we should have false mm-hmm. prophets. Yeah. That we should have false teaching and false doctrine, and that we should hear wars and rumors of wars. That we there should be pestilence and disease, and there should be the, the great sorrow in, in, in the land, and that we are living in that day and time. Paul said, "With perilous time, but we are living in those days. We are living in dangerous, dangerous times. But we still that." Finding people that are in the body of Christ, that we find them that they are they are asleep, mm-hmm. they they are sleeping. You know, we can also say sleeping in a dangerous time. You know, in see in that very moment that that would they were sleeping in a dangerous time. You know, a lot of times that we say, you know, we 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 watch. We may be watched. We may be watching, but. But we are not tentative. We're not paying. We're not paying attention. Now, it's, if I was going to use a definition of watch, I would say to be looking and waiting attentively, mm-hmm. attentively. Yeah. You and know, then, see, you see, because that we we supposed to we supposed as Christian as believers that we supposed to be alert, huh? Uh-huh. To be on alert. <laughs> Other words for us to be on guard. Uh-huh. See, all we should always be on 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 guard. We should always just looking at what is going on around us. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. But he said that he said right here. He said that ye watch and pray. Now it's a good thing to it's a good thing to watch and good thing to see exactly what is going on around you. Huh? But he said that that you watch, you be alert, you you look, yes. you look out, you look and yes. see, and you see because you can also look and see exactly what God is doing. Mm-hmm. Huh? But even in your watch, God is still yet, you know, you still have to have that communication with God. You still have to be and you still have to be in the secret. You still have to be, have that communion, that fellowship, so that you can keep up with exactly what is going on in this day and time. Uh-huh. See, because that we have to look at this and that, 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 that. It said that. Oh my God! It said that. <laughs> it said that ye enter not into temptation. Yes. So other words, the other words are that if we don't watch. If we don't watch, if we just pray and don't watch, we're going to fall into temptation. That's right. Yeah, Satan is yes. going to catch us by surprise. Uh huh. Because if you watch it, if you watch it, what's going on around you, he won't catch you by surprise. Uh huh. See, right. see, because if you plan, uh-huh. if you plan that any trap that Satan is setting before you, God will let you know. God will let you know exactly what is going on around you. But you're watching. You're on alert because because on alert you're very attentive, attentively. Amen. See, because yes. you you you're waiting. You're looking. Oh my God. He said that you enter not into temptation. Uh huh. See, because because the reason why that we see a lot of people are falling because they're not watching. Amen. And the and the, and they're not praying. Uh huh. Oh my God. Uh-huh. <laughs> Amen. All right. Come on. Oh my God. Lord Jesus. And, oh my God. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. And the spirit Lord. indeed is willing. Other words, other uh-huh. words that the, the, the spirit is, is the spirit is willing. The spirit wants to do those things that the pleases God, but the flesh is weak. <laughs> uh-huh. See, see, because that see because the spirit of God <laughs> wanted them to pray. But their flesh is, is, is weak and they 
just fell, he just fell, they just fell off, yeah. fell off to sleep. Amen. But but he asked the oh, question God. Is yeah. that, that when you spend time with God, see but when you get when you spend time with God, time has no value when you spend time with God. Prayer uh, has no limit time. It, it's not it doesn't see you don't put no time 30 minutes, you, you don't put no time 15 minutes, you don't put no time on it at an hour. But but it's so very obvious that Jesus asked the question, can you just pray with me just for just for one hour, but it's very obvious that it appeared like they did not have a prayer life. They, he did, they, they, did, they didn't have a, that, that prayer life like Jesus. Uh-huh. Amen. Uh-huh. They didn't know what it means to be intimate with God. <laughs> he, Peter didn't know that. <laughs> uh-huh. Uh-huh. Can you pray for just one hour? And just for and the just for this is that the hour was at hand for Jesus to be betrayed. Mm -hmm. The soldiers was on their way. Mm -hmm. They had already had broke bread in the in the early part of that. They had already had communion. Uh huh. Huh? Mm -hmm. But but it was his time. It was time for change. Mm -hmm. Huh? Amen. Uh -huh. Change was change was beginning. Change was taking place as as Peter was asleep. Change was was taking place. Change was taking place in Jesus when he was in Gethsemane. Change was taking place. Uh -huh. No, see, because we got to look at we watching change things changes before our before our face, uh -huh. and we got to look at what 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 are we looking at? Mm How -hmm. uh, what are we see see because we could be looking the wrong way. Uh -huh. You got to make sure because if you're in prayer, you can you see you 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 is focused. See because they you're not looking in the in the, in the wrong way. Mm -hmm. See because if you're not praying, if you're not if you're not watching and you're not praying, you can be looking in the wrong way. God mm -hmm. is looking be looking at taking in that direction, but you're looking in this direction. You're looking at all over here and uh -huh. over there. Yes. Your eyes is your eyes is off of God. You see, because you you got to make sure that that oh my God that that you are spending time with God so that you can keep your eyes, mm -hmm. you can keep your ears open, you can keep your heart open to receive God's instruction. Amen. Amen. Oh glory Amen. to God. Uh huh. Oh glory to God. Got to got to hear me on that. God, 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 and God instruction. I'm watching everything that is going on around me because change. Things are changing. Things are changing in my life. My see, because I'm watching, I'm seeing change. I may not see a drastic change at one time, but I'm seeing change. Mm -hmm. I'm seeing change within me. You know, see, because when you're watching, God can show you the changes that is in your individual life. God can show you the changes in your attitude, in your behavior, the way you think, the way you do things, the way you walk, and the way you talk. You be, you begin to, you watch, and you right. see those That's changes right. because God yeah. is revealing those changes to you. Uh -huh. Oh my God! Oh, oh my God! Did, 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 did you hear me on that? See, see, because that, see, because that, we sometimes that we're watching for little, we're watching for big things, and God is moving in the little. God is moving in the little, and and, and the little things. Thank you, Lord. Oh, glory to God. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Let's go over here to Proverbs. Proverbs, the eighth chapter. Thank you, Lord, for your word. Proverbs, the eighth chapter. And uh, hmm. I believe it's the 36th verse. Amen. Proverbs, the, the eighth chapter, and verse 36. I'm going to read it out of the living, the living Bible. Proverbs, the eighth chapter. And verse 32. Are you there? Amen. Yeah. It said, now, children, listen to me. Huh? Because those who follow me, those who follow my ways are happy. Now, now, my children, listen to me. Because
because those who follow my ways are happy. 